Welcome back, Yai Gang, and today I'm back with another video. Today I'm gonna be doing a kind of requested video, a cooking video, because you guys would like when I cook. And today it is Tuesday, so I'm going to be making some taco Tuesday. Yesterday I was watching this video about some girl like making some tacos, and I was like, oh my gosh, I really, really want tacos. Today, since it's Tuesday, I'm finally gonna make some tacos. I Went to Walmart, get some stuff for some to get some stuff for soft tacos and hard tacos, and I'm gonna be cooking. No. And my mom is inside. You guys probably saw her when I was on the swing. And I just want to do this all by myself. I don't want any help. Well, she's probably gonna help. But I'm gonna be showing you guys how I like make tacos, and I'm really hungry because I was like, I really really want tacos, and I'm kind of having my mom finally like agree. Um, to make tacos today. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, comment down below if you like tacos. I like soft tacos better than hard tacos. Oh, at Taco Bell, there's this taco that I used to love, but they got it off the menu, so I don't eat tacos at Taco Bell. I eat something else. And we're gonna start. I'm gonna show you got everything that I got from Walmart. Okay, bye. I'm inside, and I'm gonna show you everything that I have. So I have these shells, and then we have the soft tacos, and we have some chicken breast and beef. I'm gonna make these at the same time, not in the same pot, but I wanna make them like at the same time. And then we have some sour cream. Don't really care for sour cream, but I got it. And we got some taco blend cheese. We have some diced yellow onions. Um, Frothy seasoning, but I'm also going to be using my own seasoning because this isn't enough. We have some shredded lettuce, some diced tomatoes, and here some mild mm. salsa, and then guac. I try to make my, oh, a mild salsa. I guess it is the same. Oh no, I think this is different. This is different. This is mild salsa. Okay. But I tried to make my own guac. It didn't work out, so. Yep, so I don't know if I'm gonna do this, but I think I'm gonna I'm gonna clean the chicken breast first. My mom taught me how to clean them. Um, so I'm gonna cut the things and I'm gonna boil some water and do that while we wait. And then when the water is finished boiling, I'm gonna clean it again and then I'm gonna actually like start making everything. So let's boil some water. Okay, I can't vlog, but I usually use this. This is actually really nice. I'm just gonna... Oh, it's not. Okay. But I'm not gonna do a vlog first, so... I'm actually... I need to go faster. Okay, this is like a lot, but let's switch because we need some water on it. I'm gonna put it right. Oh my gosh, I could use this, but it doesn't matter because I already did it. And now, let's, I'm gonna do, I think three, how many does it come in? I don't know, I think I might do two or three, because it's a lot and there's only four people. And usually when we, when we used to do Taco Tuesday, there's like a lot of people at our house, but since it's only the four of us, I'm gonna do a little bit and sometimes they want beef. So I'm gonna do the chicken and the beef. Okay guys, so right now I have the chicken, there's three, get the big kind of six. But I have my chicken right now, my mom's playing camera. Hey Yaya again. So now I'm going to cut this little pieces off. So yeah, right now Yaya's gonna do the chicken, she's gonna clean the meat. So I am helping Yaya, she wanted to do Taco Tuesday so bad. And y'all know she loves cooking. So we're gonna just clean the kitchen the chicken, get rid of all of that fat. Once we're done with that, we're gonna like clean it up mm. real good. And then we're gonna move on to the beef. Okay, okay guys, so I finished cutting up the chicken. So we used two chickens and I put some salt and lemon juice and we just let that sit. And then now we have our beef and I gotta mush it up. It's so cold, mom. Okay, so. <sighs> 
The beef is actually really easy to make. I made beef before. You made chicken before too. You made tacos before. You forgot. No, I know, but the beef is gonna be easier to cook. Yeah, but you made both before. Yeah, I know. I know. Don't worry about it. Yeah, so we just gonna let this sit. And then we're gonna pour hot water on it and then finish cleaning it. And then what are we gonna do after? We're gonna cook it. No, before we cook it. Clean it. We're cleaning it now. I mean, we rinse it though. Get this. And then what do we do before, after? Seasoning it. Yeah, so we're gonna season it real good so it tastes delicious. Yeah. Okay, guys, so we just, chicken's finished getting clean, so. Yeah, no bien, no bien show de bien. You know what that mean? No. Okay. What does it mean? No show de bien, no bien nettoyé. That was longer than you said the first time. But we're gonna be using this dash original seasoning blend. So. Now you have some complete seasoning. My mom told me to put a lot. No, you're not gonna put a lot because you already put a lot of the dash. Okay, so. Sorry. Beef? Yeah. Sorry, that was a lot. No, that was a lot in the beef. Sorry, do more? Yeah. Okay, next we have some onion powder. Wait, this is a lot. Okay. And then. Next, we have garlic powder. I use onion powder. Don't garlic. put the garlic powder in the beef. Okay, I use garlic powder for and onion powder for almost everything. And then next, we have some cayenne pepper. Yeah. Like Let's put a little bit because that makes it real spicy. Next, we have the taco seasoning original mix. We're gonna add um, them both. So we're gonna add it like half of this. Wait, and then the rest in here. Okay guys, so I moved because there was no space over there. So I got two spoons and we're gonna stir it. I'm gonna stir the beef first. This one seems really easy. No, it doesn't. It's not easy. Comment down below if you like beef tacos or chicken tacos. I like chicken tacos with um, uh, with the um, soft one, the soft taco. I don't really care for hard tacos. They're not my favorite anymore. So, so now I have the chicken and we're gonna stir this one. I I make chicken like almost all the time because my pastas, the chicken alfredo pastas, but I might make that, actually I don't know. When should I make that? Should I do a video making it? I don't know. Comment down below if you guys will want that video because that's like really, that's really easy. I don't know why it just started working. So now, since this is like kind of on um, mix, you can, oh, this is like really good. Really good. So now we're gonna start cooking it. So we're gonna cook the, this, the chicken, and you see that pan? And then this, I'm still gonna figure out which one we should cook. So, let's go. Okay, so now we have extra virgin olive oil. We're gonna put it like in the middle, high and medium. We're not gonna put it extra high, but it's a little bit hot. So we're gonna get it everywhere so it doesn't stick to the pan. I think you should add a little bit more oil. Okay. So now we could just let it um, sit. And then, should I start the beef too? Yeah, we're gonna, yeah, it's gonna do a bowl, something to cook the beef in. Okay guys, so I found the pot that I'm gonna be using and I put some oil and I like spread it around. So That one is for the beef? Yes, and this one's for the chicken. And it just all comes out back in the middle. It just kind of snacks. Now we're gonna add the chicken. Wait until it's like this dark brownish color, like a tan. Yeah, stir it out, And this we wait until it's completely brown. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna let everything cook. We'll be back. Okay, guys. So right now I am so making it. So the beef kind of looks like it's done. I'm just gonna let it sit there a little longer. This one's cooking really fast, 
could wait maybe 10 minutes. And then this, I'm still waiting. So I'm stirring it. I've been watching it, I haven't been going really far. I just can't wait to eat because I'm really hungry. Okay guys, so my meat is almost done. The beef is um, completely ready. So right now I'm gonna bake these. It says to six to seven minutes. So we're gonna put these in the oven so they're like real crispy. Okay, how many should I put? Um, you wanna do like six of each? Sure. All right, so yeah. that's what we're gonna do, you guys. We are gonna bake these up. We just turned on the oven. Okay, let's see. One, two, three. Taco, taco Tuesday! Woo! Oh, we're gonna need two because it's not a lot of space. So let's get some scissors. Are you excited? Yeah, okay, I, I can't find any scissors. Okay, we're gonna find some scissors. We're gonna find some. Don't panic, stay calm. Stay calm, we're gonna oh, find some. Right okay. Right okay, we found the scissors. Okay. How many should I make of this? Oh, six each. I yeah. Okay. I always, I usually make this over a skillet, but since I, it's gonna kind of be a long time, so let's just do it all together. Okay, guys. So I kind, of, I kind of made it work. Um, so I just put these together, and then I have the rest. They're kind of on top of each other. But now we're gonna add them to the oven, and we're gonna put it on a timer for seven minutes. And that's how long it says. So let's, um, do, and we'll see you guys in seven minutes. Okay guys, so right now, everything is ready. The chicken besides that, we have three more minutes left. So we're gonna be adding our ingredients in here. The sides? Yeah. Okay, I think that's enough onions for this. I don't even think anyone's gonna eat, but we're gonna put it right here. I'm gonna eat onions, but just not a lot. So let's put some sour cream. Is that good? Oh, that more. It looks like it looks like ice cream for McDonald's. You know when they um, pour the ice cream from the machine? It looks like that. We kind of want to get more of this. Okay. Next, we're gonna be adding some salsa. 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 Salsa, 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 salsa. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cheese. Cheese is Taco okay. blend cheese. Wow. We love cheese. We could add a lot. Okay. And this is our lettuce. Okay. Now this is a lot you should add because I love lettuce. Okay. That was and now for guac, I also love guac. Remember last time you made the guac from scratch? Why you didn't do that this time? Because I told them because it wasn't the best guac. So. Oh, you didn't like how you made it? Uh -uh, so. And more guac, girl. Yeah. Guac be busting. Busting to like busting. I love guac. Okay, guys, so now that everything is done, look at my fish. Look at everything, it's so good. So what is this? That is chicken. What is beef. this? This is the hard taco, soft taco. <laughs> Guacamole, lettuce, cheese, salsa, sour cream, and then this is diced onions. Okay, you guys, so I'm not gonna lie. It this is look looking good. really good. Like, yeah, yeah, you did your thing once again. My girl be putting it down in the kitchen. It be going down. Shout out to Yaya. Y'all, write her in her DMs, let her know what else she should cook because Yaya is a chef. She can make anything, like. Now, what I wanna make next, I wanna make a dessert. So also, go to my DMs and put entree and a dessert. An uh, entree and dessert? Yeah. All right, so you ready to taste it? Yeah, okay, so we're gonna have our soft coffee. And then, let's put the guac as a first base. You wanna put the guac first? Yeah, and then I squeeze it, like, spread it around. Get everybody. Okay, next we're gonna have some chicken. So yeah, they probably gonna see this video on Thursday, but oh. just know she made it on, on to on Tuesday. Tuesday. Yeah, yeah. today is Tuesday, you guys. Taco Lettuce. Tuesday. The camera died. So let's we're gonna grab our cheese. Oh. And now we're gonna grab this. Just a little bit, and we're gonna put it in the middle. Oh, there we go. And then now we're gonna add more guacamole, just a little bit, 
and on top. Yeah, this is just a taste test. We're gonna go in later, but yeah. let's see how it tastes. Let's see how that thing yeah, came girl, out. It's like so messy. I Soft popcorn and three, two, one, three. <laughs> you guys, I tasted the meat. It was actually really good. Mmm. It tastes good? Mm hmm. It tastes really good? Mm, bustin', bustin'. It's bustin' to the bus? Bustin', bustin'. All right, Yaya says bustin', bustin'. So. <laughs> That's how good it tastes? Yeah. No, <laughs> <laughs> it tastes good. It tastes good? Mm -hmm. All right, y'all are still chewing, y'all. This chicken tastes so good, y'all. Let me steal one. Mm -hmm. Stop eating! I'm sorry. Okay, it's going down so I can talk. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow my Instagram, Yai Panton. I'm here on Snapchat, Guy Pants in 63, and I want you guys to D DM me some more foods to make. And make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Bye, guys. Peace.